I am the king of fashion. Okay, before I even go, let me just take the sports store out. I'll bring it over here. We got Dalia here, how pretty she is. Hello. Hi. <laughs> An option for everybody to take part in this uh, in this raffle. That's where we're flying to right now. guys welcome back I literally just got back home about an hour ago uh, from from a flight from a flight to Israel and it's a beautiful day as you can see Sun is out it's like now it's 40 45 and it should be getting a little bit warmer I'm gonna take the bike out and complete the next step in uh, the rear end at uh, the eliminator Sorry, the Dominator, the Dominator fender conversion, the rear end conversion on uh, on Blackbird and uh, 2020 electric light standard, as you guys know already. Let me move the uh, move the car out. Anyway, it was a long. Uh, I did two flights back to back, so 10 days. I've been uh, back and forth uh, on the line from uh, Tel Aviv, Israel, to uh, New Jersey. Get ready for uh, some breaking breaking news today. Today we're gonna be doing uh, the side panels, the stretched side panels for part of the, uh, you know, the rear end conversion. Yeah, intro now. Getting ready, getting ready for the flight. I have the second shift. Hello, there's two six heavy rolling for left 
woke up. We have these bunks where we rest, where we sleep. Uh, pretty much one for me, one for him. Today we're a double cruise for, for uh, four pilots. Two work each time, two rest. So I just uh, completed my rest time. Now I'm going to go back into the cockpit. Minimums. Minimums. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. license plate yellow yellow license plate with IL back in Israel another round trip with my buddy Mayan the guy that uh, straight over here the guy that we took uh, I took with me uh, to America last time buddy pass flying together uh, we're going to Harley Davidson straight gonna uh, grab some pins one of you guys was in the comments wrote uh, Sandy the beanie with the shades needs to be outside and not inside like something like this dude you're totally wrong i am the king of fashion it's supposed to go like this man see yeah all 
of a sudden it got so windy, I had to put my hat on and it's cold, it just rained. My buddy Alexei again. Hey guys. How you doing? <laughs> What's up? What's up, man? Huh? How are you? I've been. Got Galia here. How pretty she is. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Uh, we got uh, XLs and large, all sizes. I'm gonna get some pins. You guys love the pins. I'm gonna get pins. That's it. I'm gonna pay for the stuff. The pins are not cheap, guys. I'm telling you that that's the truth. They're not cheap. Wow, that is a nice color. זה לא משהו מאורגן. זה מה שקוראים טורקיש או גריק קופי, מדיטרניאן קופי, זה פשוט רוסטד, ברנד פרטי מוצ קופי בינס עם חוט וואטר, זה זה, זה קופי מנס קופי, זה מה, זה באמת מנס קופי. You, sh you should try it. It keeps you awake for five days. <laughs> One sip. It's a bit, I got a head like a need. my needle. My head is like a needle, but for you guys. How about that? And this one? It's like no name. Dad's hat. How about that? Bye, Lipot. Bye. Bye, bye, Galia. Thank you. Nice people here. Israel full of nice people. No chutzni. Everybody's nice. The guys took the rest of my coffee. I could go back home and get ready for my night. I have a night flight. I get back to, uh, the, to NJ uh, tomorrow morning. Peace out for now, guys. Today we're going to be doing uh, the side panels, the stretched side panels for part of the, uh, you know, the rear end conversion. Side panels are here. So this is what the bike looks like. These are the, the standard, standard panels, side panels. Let's look at the other side, look at them from here. Now we'll get, let's go get the, uh, the panels himself. They come uh, with an adjustable feature because it's such a tight fit. Let me get my chair. My little. Simple as that. Let's see. First of all, I hope that with, uh, with the new uh, side panels, I won't have problems with my uh, passenger pegs. I think first step is actually to take the saddlebags, the saddlebags off. So, okay, pretty much this is the easiest, uh, the easiest task or job on uh, on these on these bikes on the the touring bikes is taking this uh, panel off. Just pull it out, yank it out. And as you can see, it has three studs, and these studs go in right here. One two and three very nicely packed by the way with all these bubble wraps and paper by the way if i haven't said already thank you so much to advan black for sending these out to me really appreciate it they really transformed the look of the bike now on the panels on the advan black stretch bags or stretch panel or stretch panels yeah because you have to, uh, to match it up with the stretch saddlebags, there are three uh, studs that are adjustable so you can get the exact, these studs actually are adjustable. You can pull them, uh, twist them in and out. And this pretty much, uh, when you make this longer and twist it out, it changes the alignment of the whole panel. 
you'll figure it out. It's pretty pretty much self-explanatory. Put them in. Let's see how they fit. Three. Let me show you. You can actually see from here. Uh, you see right there? That's one. That's the bottom one. And there's one right over here behind there. And obviously one right behind here. So that's what it looks like. Let's uh, let's put the bag. Let's mount the bag and see if there's a good fit. Okay, I can see even with the, before I even tighten it, before I even tighten over here, you can see that it's touching over here, over here on the top. So what I want to do is actually the bolt or the uh, the nut, whatever you call it, the stud that's here, to push it out make it longer if I make it longer it's gonna push this whole thing out so this whole part is gonna go out so because as you see the bottom one is okay there's a good there's a good gap over here but here on the top it's almost like it's, it's touching you can see from the top so again I want to push this whole thing outward and that is by a triangle simply moving this backward pushing it out so let's do that. Let me show you. By simply, this stud over here, right here, this stud over here, I turned it, I, I, I twisted it uh, that it becomes longer, became longer, so it pushed the whole panel out. This part went this way, it went out, and it gave me good, good spacing right here. Because before, this was actually touching. So let me just twist it a little bit more, make it a little bit longer, and it's gonna push out the whole panel. Yep. I twisted a little bit more and got this stud to be a little bit even longer, and it pushed the plastic, the whole panel out. So now the panel has got a nice gap between the bag and the panel right here. Does it make sense what I uh, just said? Let me do the other side and I'll explain it to you again. I don't like if you got it first time, then fine. But let me just make sure everybody got it. Think of it as like a, uh, like a tent or like a structure that sits on three legs. You make uh, one leg longer than the other. You change the orientation of that of that canopy of that you know that structure so one one the minute anywhere you want to move it make that leg a little bit shorter or longer it will change the alignment and the way it sits on the bag let me do the other side It's in. Now let's put the bag and see how it fits. Oh, it fits first shot. No need to no need to, to tinker around with it. Okay, and here it's a perfect fit, first shot. Let me show you. You see the gap over here? And the gap from the top here to the bottom. Pretty much stays the same and it's not not touching over here not rubbing so it's perfect now one of the things I was concerned about is with uh, will the uh, passenger pegs touch and I think we're, we're good over here actually look oh no it's touching oh no so either have them make sure they're uh, always open a little bit or just remove them. Let me think about it. I don't know.
simple install. Uh, just playing around with the alignment, with the adjustment, so you get the perfect and flush fit between your bags and the panel. Next, next step that we're going to be doing. Look, look at the bags now. Look at the bags. Okay, what are they missing? You got it. Liners. So I have the box of liners. We're going to go into the garage now and start installing them into the bags and that's going to be a separate video okay before i even go let me just take the sportster out i'll bring it over here i'll sit in it and i'll tell you uh what this raffle is all about let me get it a few details about the sportster it's a 20 2015 iron 883 sportster i'm the second owner uh, it's got 2,000, around 2,600, 2,700 miles on it. Bike is in, in great condition, absolutely great condition. I did, uh, I put a new set of uh, pipes on it with the wrap. And I also have uh, the original uh, Vance and Hines, Vance and Hines uh, shotguns, I think they're called, I'm not sure. But you see one of my first videos of the Sportster, check out the Sportster series. You can see the pipes, I still have them. They're gonna go part of uh, whoever wins it, gets whatever I have. I have a, uh, a brown seat for, get for it. I don't remember who made it, I'll check it very soon. And I'll let you know, as you see, it has the chain conversion kit already on it. It's got a rolling sand. Uh, I think it's, the, it's either the cover or it's the actual, uh, the actual conversion kit itself. Figure machine, USA, heavy breather with uh, high air uh, intake. It's got a fuel pack three on it with uh, the proper map. And the most important, it's got beautiful Fox 14 inch shocks with uh, preload, compression, stiff, adjustments, both sides. Rides really, really nice. I love that bike and uh, you know, I already told you why I'm uh, getting, uh, not rid of it, but raffling it out because I'm getting the uh, low rider ST. Pretty much, I made the raffle easy. I did two, I created two, two packages, uh, small, small package of uh, entries. And then there's a large package of entries. Go to my website, www.holyshift.us and check out uh, the raffle. Two different packages of entries, actually very affordable. And if you don't wanna get the those entries, actually every item you get on my website, any merch piece of merchandise has a value, an entry value to it. So even a sticker that you buy for around $10 has an entry uh, value on it. So, so if you just wanna take part in this uh, raffle and, and get your chances to winning this 2015 Sportster, iron 883 just go in and grab even a simple sticker and you're entered in for the for the raffle guys i created this so we have a win-win uh situation you know for everybody uh, a few things that i did for example are these small entries so everybody can be part of it and participate and i'm really optimistic that we can reach uh, the goal if, you know small entries everybody can uh, participate in this uh also uh, you know, the, the whole goal is to be able to uh, to sell the motorcycle, uh, to sell the Sportster for a fair market value, uh, and to use that money as a down payment to get the uh, low rider ST. So we've got uh, four months ahead of us. It's a long time. The drawing is going to be May uh, May 30 May 30th. So it gives us four months, you know, to to be able to raise enough uh, to to be able to raise money through uh the entries and through sales merchandise sales so i'm pretty optimistic we can get there last thing if i'm unable to raise enough uh, money to a fair value of uh, the sportster then what uh, i'm still gonna have the drawing but first prize will be 50 percent of the profits 50 percent of the profit so i'm totally optimistic i created with your help uh an option for everybody to take part in this uh, in this raffle, and uh, head out to www.holyshift.us and take part in this raffle. Go get some, guys.
Okay, that's it for now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Watching Holy Shift. I'm Sandy. Till the next video, guys. Peace out.